Can you please stop abusing, sir? Thank you for getting connected to Avas Customer Support. How can I help you? Well, I got a uh, email for four ninety nine point ninety nine that they charged me for to renew. Uh, mm -hmm. Looks like a vast. Right. Uh, I didn't do that. I don't know what it is. Do you? Okay. Uh, can you just confirm me the order number so that I can look up the details? TR seven three seven four three zero zero dash five two two five five. Okay, just a second, please. Okay. No problem. Wait. Just... Okay, and can you just confirm me your first name? Yeah, my first name is Clint. C L I N T. Clint. Oh. Okay. Okay, so as I can see on file, this, it's a two-year antivirus subscription from Avasa. So is there any problem with the transaction? Yeah, there's a problem. I didn't order it. Yeah, there's a problem. Okay, and is it possible that somebody from your family maybe purchased it? No, why would they purchase it? Okay, no problem. I understand, sir. So as you're saying, you never approved the charge, but somehow it got through. So I would assume that this is a fraud transaction in that case. Is that correct? Well, if I didn't do it, yeah. But how do we... Uh, I don't understand this whole thing. I, I don't understand yes. it at all. It's a fraud transaction, sir. So what is possible that somebody has stolen your information and they have provided to it to us and they made the transaction go through. So as this is fraud, I completely understand. I'll be helping you out with the cancellation and the refund right now. So just let me know that or a laptop. Okay. okay. Now do let me know, sir. Are you in front of your computer right now or do you need some time? No, I'm sitting in front of it. Okay, so what you need to do, sir, is to open up your web browser, like if you have Google Chrome, that will do. I got to start it. It's sleeping. We got to start it up. That's okay. Take your time. Let me know once your computer is on. Okay, it's on. Okay. Now just open up your web browser. If you have Google Chrome, that would be great if you can open it. I got Google. Okay. 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 All right. It's open. Right. Okay. Now on the top of your screen, you will see there is a search bar where you can type and look for something on the internet, right? Yes, yes. Okay. Just type there A as an apple, right? Now you need to hit on enter and let me know what can you see on your enter. screen. Enter. Mm -hmm. Support now, access any device, download now. Okay. Right. And this, because this is a fraud order, sir, and you never intended to make the transaction, we'll be giving you the free version for one-time use only, okay? So you need to give a click on download now. Free version of what? This? Of, yes, free version of this so that you can get connected to the security department. Oh, and we, okay, good. Right. Okay. So you, you need to give yeah, a click on get, download get, get, now. Click, I did download, okay. Now okay. there's a thing, now, any desk EXE over in the corner. You, right, you, you need to open that. Do you think I should that. click on that? Okay, I'll open mm -hmm. that. And then, mm -hmm. okay, now it says your address, install, mm -hmm. discovery. Okay. And you will see there's a new icon on your desktop called any desk. You just need to yeah. open that. Open mm -hmm. that. Okay. Now do you see a nine-digit number called address or desk? Address. Uh, do you see on the top right hand corner of that page there are four lines? Yeah. Okay, give a click on it and tell me if you see it says set password over there. Yes, yeah, set password. Okay. Right. Give a give a click on it and tell me if you can see it says set password and confirm password, okay? It says do you want to allow this app to make changes? Yes. Okay, now it says set password. Right, now type there Avast, A-V-A-S-T, all in small letters, okay? Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay. So, and now just confirm the same thing below where it says confirm password, Avast, one, two, three, four. Okay. Now just apply. click on, 
Right. Correct. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Now, just give me a second. Once you see Ava Security Department server coming up on your screen, you just have to let me know. Okay. Okay. Security warning. Is that what you mean? That will come up, and then you will see our Another security department. Another person would okay. like to access your device. Okay. Okay. Do let me know one thing, sir. The password that you put in, did you put Avast all in small letters? Yes. Okay. What did you type? Can you tell me, please? One, two, three, four. Avast one, two, three, four. Right. Okay. But for some reason, it's not taking, sir. So can you just check if you have your capital letters on? No, I don't. Okay. No problem. I'll just go ahead and try to get you connected again. That's okay. 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 So if you see any option called allow or accept, sir, try to give a click on it, okay? Because for some reason, it's not working from my end properly. Okay. Security warning again. Accept. Right. Accept that. Okay. Now this is a vast security department. Right. So now just give a click on allow, accept, continue, whatever option you get. Accept. Okay. Session started. Right. Now just do one thing. That small box that you see for the any desk, just minimize that. Okay. Okay. Now just open the any desk once again, sir. Okay. Right. And once again, just go to the set password section once again, please. Set password. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. So now just type password. there. Right. Now okay. just type there once again, all in small letters, Avast, A-V-A-S-T. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then just repeat the same thing below. Okay. Then do you see something called as permissions profile maybe? Yeah. Go to that. Give a click on full access. And then apply? Right, right. Correct, sir. Okay. Okay. Now, as you have already seen the uh, AVA security department, sir, tell me, can you see it says global settings on your screen, interactive access? Where? No. Uh, oh, on the up top. Uh, yeah, I see mm -hmm. it. Okay. Okay. Now, on, on that screen, you will see there are multiple checkboxes, right? Small checkboxes? Yeah. Okay. Just... Scroll down a little bit and see there, what, there will be one checkbox called Enable Privacy Mode. Can you see that? Enable Privacy, privacy mode. mode. Yes. I don't see it. Just look very carefully, sir. It's in the middle of all the checkboxes. Okay, I see it. Okay, I clicked okay. it. There, now right. we're all set. Okay. Now it's check marked, right? Yeah. Okay, so as you have set a new password, sir, let me just go ahead and try to get you connected properly to the security department. Okay. So just Okay, so once again, if you see the security warning, just let me know. Yeah, it's here again. Okay, let that be. Okay, okay. the password function is still not now working. Now it's a session started again. Right. Just now I got the security allow... thing again. I don't know what's going on here. That's okay, sir. It's just that the oh. password thing is not properly working, okay? So give a click on allow once again. Allow what? I don't know what you're talking about. Do you see there is an option coming up on your screen right now called allow, accept, anything? Security warning again? Yes. Do you see there is an option called allow or accept on it? Accept. I did. Yes. Give a click on it. Give okay. a click on it once again. Okay. Okay. Now, once again, just minimize the Avast security department box, okay? The smaller box, the first box. Okay. All right. Right. Now, just minimize the global settings box. Okay. Right. Now, just where you can see the nine-digit number, you will see there's a small lock icon between the help and the invite sign. Just look at the lock sign. Okay. I see it now. Right. Give a click on it. Yes. Now, now so I'll set give password you... again. How many times I got to set a password? Just give me my fucking money back. Sir, it's for security reasons. Please do not abuse, okay? I'm trying to help you out here. But you're trying to help me, but this is taking way too long to cancel something I didn't order. 
It's a fraud transaction, sir. Somebody is uh, misusing your information, so we are trying to uh, block uh, out that person, okay? Well, block him. What the fuck? How long is this going to take? Can you please stop abusing, sir? Stop abusing what? What am I abusing? I'm not doing anything. Okay. Now, please just type there, all in small letters, A-L-I. A-L-I. C-E. C-E. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Right. And uh, do you see it says the password is sufficient? Yes, it does. Oh, okay. Now just type the same thing in. A-L-I-C-E-1-2-3. E-1-2-3. Okay. Now just give me a second. Now just hit on apply. Okay. Okay. Now just hold on. Okay. I'm just trying to help you out, that's all, sir. It takes time because this is a fraud transaction. So don't well, do anything. How just come it takes so long? Why does it take so long to cancel something I didn't fucking order? Okay, once again, just simply give a click on accept, okay, once you get the option. Okay, session started again. How many times have we got to start the session? Can't we just get this over with? Sir, I'm just trying to help you out, that's all. Somebody is well, misusing your information. You need to well, understand that. Can we get that. this over with? Fairly quickly? That's exactly what I'm trying to do, sir. Oh, you're... Okay. If you get an option to give a click on accept, please do that, okay? Yeah, sure. Okay. So, we are done with the cancellation. What you can do now is to just go ahead and open up whatever browser you use. Okay. Right. Now, we are done with the cancellation, so the only part that is left right now is the refund. So, in whichever account you would like to receive your refund in, simply log into that account. Once you are in, just let me know. Okay, what am I looking for in my bank account? Okay, so are you in, that means? Yeah, I'm in the bank account. What, do I, what am I okay. looking for? Just be on hold, sir. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create the, generate the refund link for you. So, in a minute, once you see the money hit into your account, you just have to let me know. That's all, okay? Uh, okay. You sure? Yes. Just give me a second. Okay. Hello? Anybody there? Yes, sir. I'm right here. I'm just wait, waiting for my banking department to give me the update. Well, how long is this going to take? Okay, can you just do one thing, sir? You can just go ahead and put me on mute. You can just go continue with your work. So once I have the update, I'll let you know, okay? How are you going to let me know if I put you on mute? Just put me on speaker, that's all. Just get this over with. Sir, can you stop screaming, please? It's really well, hard for me to hear you once you're screaming. Well, I'm, get I'm getting mad. I understand that, sir, but I'm not the one who did anything with your information, right? I'm just trying to help you. So please be but, patient. But you guys let the charge go through, right? I mean, so we I had, didn't let it sir, go through. We had no, right. So we had no idea that it was a fraud order, sir, until you called us. We thought it was just a regular order. How would we know that it's a fraud order unless you tell us, sir? So please be patient well, and give me now. two minutes. I'm telling you now, cancel it. Just cancel right. it. Why uh, we got to go through all this shit? Because this is the process, sir. So please be patient. Be on hold for two minutes. Just a minute. Sally Sue, put that fucking duck outside. Well, you're the one who wanted the fucking thing. You wanted the fucking duck. Yeah, okay. Come here. Get out here. Go ahead, Dappy. Come out. Get out. You're welcome. Don't be so complainy. <sighs> Hello? Anybody there? How long have I got to wait? Okay, you can do one thing, sir. You can just hang up this line. Once I have any information, I'm going to give you a call back. Just let the any desk be as it is, okay? No, I'm not going to do that, you fucking thief. Excuse me? Excuse you? What you do, fart? Okay, so in this situation, I, sir, I won't be you, going you ahead rundy, with the cancellation, you okay? You rundy thief. You rundy thieving bastard. Great. You piece of shit. You're a thief, lady. Better call that slut back. Thank you for calling customer care. How can I help you? 
Yeah, I was talking to some Rundy, and she's trying to steal my money. Is she there? Who are you stupid? talking to? Stupid. I said there was some Rundy I was talking to. She tried to get into my fucking bank account. She's a fucking thief. What? Uh, what? Uh, and so you? are you. You're a scam bastard your own self. She wanted... Oh, okay. Please leave your message for 5672692159. Hello, you thieving pieces of shit. How are you? I'll call you back. Don't worry about it. I know you miss me, you fucks. Message for 5672. Fuck you, man! Goddamn! 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 Go